Sprint, sprint, sprint. Oh, it's close. Oh my god. Thank you so much. <laughs> what have I just seen? What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to a brand new video and today we're going to be looking at the brand new EX1 Assault Raffle. This Assault Raffle guys actually has multiple different functions as a sniper, a DMR, SMG and obviously the Assault Raffle itself. We have four different versions but we're only going to be focusing on two as personally I believe the other ones are not that good. Big shout out guys to the notification gang from the last video. I appreciate each and every one of you for supporting the channel and let me know down in the comments what guns you want to see in the new video. Let's hop on over to the build now guys. I love you all and I hope you enjoy the video. So guys we're going to jump into the build quickly and just give me a couple of seconds to explain because there are multiple different variations you can use with this weapon so guys the variations you can have is actually going to be an assault rifle version which is the same if you don't have an actual barrel at all or if you want to put this on for like a better version of it uh, you can have a burst version a close so like smg version uh, you can then have a DMR version and then you can have a sniper rifle version. Now the sniper rifle actually charges up so you press it down, you can hold on to it. Once it's fully charged you can then crack people pretty much um, anywhere once you hit them with it and then obviously it will then take one more shot to actually kill them. The sniper version is kind of good, you'll see obviously some clips with this. I've also guys given it a try on the DMR version, it's really not that good so it's up to you if you want to try it, I wouldn't advise it. I've tried using this as well guys, again it's okay but the SMG you're better off just using an actual SMG than using this version. The burst version as well, we've given this a try. Again, not that worth using. It's just not that powerful at all. So again, the burst version also isn't really worth it. It just doesn't have damage in there. And this is actually going to be the main attachment I'll be using. It's going to be the full assault rifle version. And it just makes it so that you get a little bit more stability and recoil control at long ranges. So this is going to be like the main build we use. But as I said, guys, there is a sniper support version and a DMR version. I would only advise using maybe the sniper if you really want to try it out but the main one is going to be the assault rifle version and it is a close to medium range assault rifle long range it doesn't really do anything okay two 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 oh my god i'm jumping out that these boxes don't want to die from this right behind this rock. Uh, His body went flying, bro. Oh my god, this new SMG is so good. Nick, I do not lose this fight, cool. thank you. I think he's underground. Okay. Let's go! <laughs> that game was so quick. Sweat. Nice. Oh my god. I mean, he nearly killed you. Pro farm on. I'm so warm. No, it wasn't fully charged. My sniper wasn't fully charged. Oh, oh I can't, I can't help. I got you, got him. I, I'm trying to learn. Okay, the sniper is really weird and hard to use, dude. Bro, 
broke him, knocked him, finished him. Broke him. It's a nice little sniper, it's definitely a nice cool little sniper, but I don't know.